chug, 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 chug. All right. This week's Drink of the Week segment. What do we have here? We have Empire Brewing Company's Black Magic Pumpkin Stout. So although we thought last week would be the end of the pumpkin run, we had one more to go. <laughs> one more. Hey, it's still it's still fall. Still works. Yeah. Just we're not completely in the winter warmer area yet with Christmas. No, we're not. But this is a this is a scrumptious, creamy, roasty, six and a half point alcohol by volume stout. It is brewed and packaged in Ellicottville, New York. Um does it say doesn't say uh there's no breakdown on what's in it. Um I like the can. The can's cool looking. Yeah. Um hopefully this hits better than um you know the masters, the troves masters of pumpkin that you guys oh. crapped on last week. Oh. Um this is gonna be room temp for me, but I haven't turned my heat on yet. So oh, good thing. <laughs> what are you doing? The British style over there, huh? <laughs> you said the text, and I was like, I'm not getting up, and I didn't. <laughs> Have you been up at all? <laughs> this this smell this smells like this smells like a, a pumpkin pie in a glass. It like does, I'm getting yeah. straight pumpkin pie out of this, smelling it. That's creamy. That's what she I said. I feel like I'm. I feel like I'm. <laughs> it's one of their adjectives, okay, doll. <laughs> I feel like I'm drinking pumpkin pie. Yes. Like all, all I'm missing is cool. All I'm missing is cool whip or ready whip on top of this. Like this is. God literally... damn! Why did you say that? I have pumpkin spice cool whip in the fridge. Oh. <laughs> you <laughs> hey, you're always adding stuff to beer. You're all yeah. cool stuff. there. You go. <laughs> this is really, this is really good. I hate it, but I don't. Is that what you say all the time? No, I, I, I could have. I was expecting you to hate this. So. <laughs> I hate all styles. Even just a smidge. Yeah, I, yeah. I just, I'm with you too. I hate all styles, but man, this is tasty. This is, yeah. So Jay, on on your ratings, is I would have another or not? Would Would you have another? If you gave it to me, yeah. I'm not reaching the cooler for it. If I spice it up with your uh, pumpkin spice Cool Whip on top, you'll you'll definitely drink it. Oh, definitely. You put you put that on. You put Cool Whip on anything. I'm I'm eating it. Sorry. And, <laughs> yeah, you are. <laughs> you guys are in the wrong segment. That's this guy. Man. <laughs> he looked at that camera and he gave that anything. <laughs> 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 All right, yeah. sumo scale one to five. Donald, what you got? I'll give this. Um, shockingly, it's it's a stout. I'll give it a a four point two. This is tasty. Damn, wow. this this is That's good. I, I like this. I really do. Yeah, Chris, it's good. I mean, it, what how they describe it. You know, of scrumptious, creamy, and roasty. Yes, yes, and yes. Um, I think I'm gonna go three point five. I'll give it. I'll have another. Uh, yeah, I'm. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go three seven five on this. Like I said, it, to me, it, it's literally pumpkin pie in a beer. Um, pumpkin pie as a beer, like that's in a stout. Yeah. yeah, in a Even stout. A stout um, and... That's um. I don't want to say that's the most pumpkiny like. Out of the out of the pumpkin beers that we've had, right? Like whole hog, take whole hog out of the equation because whole hog is, is separate <laughs> by itself. That's all. Yeah. <laughs> but that that one that one to me the most has the the flavor profile that I enjoy if I'm drinking a pumpkin beer. Yeah. You know, Trogues last week was wasn't like. Wasn't that like I said? It, it, I, the only way I can describe it is literally like pumpkin pie as a beer. So if you guys like pumpkin pie, I would highly recommend this beer. If you don't like pumpkin pie, then pass on it. But if definitely, you're a stout if you drinker, and maybe pumpkin beers aren't your thing because you, you prefer stouts over the ales, this is something to try. Yeah, I would definitely scoop this up if you still see it out. So, 
That's a that's a hell of a way to go out on the on on a banger there with the pumpkins. Well yeah. done, Chris. Yes. Well done. Yes, very well done. Mm-hmm. Jeez. Yeah. Is, I'd buy this like this. next season. I will look for this again. Yeah, like I'm I'm mad I'm I'm kind of mad that I only have one to drink right now. <laughs> like I wish like after the show I'd have you know I'd have a couple more in the fridge yeah. to just kind of like throughout the rest of the day. Um but yeah, this is yeah, that, that hits on all levels. So yeah, I'm six that. and a half. It's something that you could and I like the carbonation in there mm-hmm. too. So it's something that you can drink, I think, a couple of them and be happy with that. Yeah, I'm not drinking a six pack because it is a stout and the the weight of it will will get too heavy. But no, if I if I have two two to three of those over the course of like hanging out and bullshitting and whatnot, like yeah, I'm I'm in all that. I think the carbonation helps with the stout, so it's not sitting in your stomach real heavy afterwards. But no, that's a that's a that's a positive uh, yeah. review there for Jesus. for the Black Magic Pumpkin Stout, and Love with that. that. Raise your cups, glasses, brown paper bags, shot glasses, red and blue so cups, whatever you're drinking with this week, and to good ships and wood ships and ships that sail the seas. The best ships are friendships, and friends will always be.